Hi, I am Thomas, an internet OSI staff. In this time, I worked on a project from the perspective of our customers. The main goal of the project was to use time series data stored in a Pi system and convert it to information so decisions could be made proactively. The project I worked on was solar energy monitoring. Traditionally, electricity was predominantly produced from fossil fuels. Currently, renewables such as solar energy are becoming more prominent. The electricity generated from solar power will dictate how much electricity to produce from other sources to keep supply in line with demand. This is both an economical and safety issue. To be able to predict the solar power generation a week in advance will be greatly valuable to the energy industry. My project focuses on using machine learning forecasting methods to do just this. This is my result in Pi Core site. This blue line is the actual solar power generated. This orange line is a standard Arima prediction that doesn't use any other attributes than the historical solar power generation data. This third line in red is my prediction using decision forest regression. It uses other attributes and determines the relationships between them. As you can see, the decision forest regression is more accurate as it utilizes and exploits the relationships between attributes. To make this, I firstly centralized my data from various sources into our Pi data archive using the Pi connector for UFL. By organizing and structuring my data in an AF hierarchy, I was able to contextualize my data easily. The structure allowed me to easily calculate population weight and attributes for the state level from the city level. This data was exported using the Pi Integrator for Business Analytics and analyzed in Azure Machine Learning Studio. For my scenario, I could choose from a selection of regression models. The modeling will develop relationships between attributes. I use two months of historical data to train my models. Once my model is trained, we may use the existing forecasted attributes to determine the future solar power generated. To conclude, I believe all businesses should leverage machine learning to transition to proactive decision making.